All right, boys. Uh, look, if if this isn't obvious, I'm I'm in a hotel. Uh, cause I'm shooting the thing with Germa right now. If you don't know what that is, here's a clip of it. I, I'm assuming that you you must be the, the maid. I heard you ordered a sexy maid service. But but I'm I'm away. I'm at a hotel, and I figured I've been asked this a lot. Today I would do something that, um, frankly, a lot of you guys need. Okay, can we down here a little? It's a it's a little high. Just can you guys come down to my level? So today we're gonna do a hair tutorial. This is this is what it would look like if I never did my hair. All right, I do my hair every day. I would look like Justin Bieber circa 2008. All right, pre pissing into the janitor's bucket, Bieber. Okay, kind of a good era, but still a little too young for for me. I'm 26 now, um, and I'll and I'll show you how to be an adult. All right, fellas, hair tutorial, boys. Girls already figured this shit out, by the way. Like, 40 years ago, whenever Paris Hilton was born, they figured this out, they already groom and look good and shit, and a lot of fellows out there, not gonna cap, a lot of you guys could use one, more frequent haircuts, okay? Don't be the guy that just waits to get a haircut until it's too long, and then you're forced to get a haircut because it's so long that people comment on it. Or two, you, you don't do anything with it. You just get out of the shower and you go, and then that's it. So look, all I've done so far, all I've done, you're a little tilted, looking like my eyeballs, okay. All I've done is is showered, okay? This was me earlier. I'm gonna regret this. And then, why am I explaining to you like you're a seven year old on how to shower? Okay, you get it. Does anyone else just steal toilet paper from hotels? I don't care how much I made during the subathon, I mean. Things feel better when they're not on your dime. All right, step one, making your hair. You gotta have three things. A brush, oh, product, and a blow dryer. And if your name's Slime, you'll see the fourth thing, it's hair. Then you can do your hair if you have all of those things. And step one is just getting it, getting it how you want it. I don't know, some people like parting it to the other side, some people maybe like it slicked back. Some people maybe don't want it, I don't know. There's other ways to wear your hair. I specifically just put it to the right. High. Like it's on high. There's zero product right now, but I'm, but I'm shaping what I want. This is, look at this, this is fucking ridiculous. What is, what is happening? Okay, I, that should be enough, I don't know. Enough? to cover an Oreo on thin Oreo for like healthy people, but not like a regular Oreo. Rub it in your hands, whatever it is, if it's um, a wax or a pomade or a fiber, uh, you should be able to rub it until it's, it's, it's not visible. Not dissolved, but you know, not visible. And then with your fingers, you, you, you cover the problem areas, all right? This is what the fingers do, okay? Just the problem area. You have a shit ton on your palm, we're ignoring the palms. We're just on the trouble areas with the fingers, in my trouble area is here, I got a cow lick, a gnarly cow lick um, from Bert, from my parents fucking up. Something, I don't know. I also have a chest hole and I had a burst appendix and I also had a thyroglossal duct cyst, so. They fucked up a lot. My grandparents are cousins. I've never told Stream that before, but it's true, this is a fact. I don't know, it was normal, I guess, in the early 1900s, but uh, either way, uh, my body's not it's fucked up. But now I'm using my palms to get it on the main spot. Cause the main shit is that I want it to go boom, and then boom. And already we're kind of getting there, but it's still wet. Especially with this black tank top, it's giving off too much greaser energy. Which is not my goal. Alright. Now you gotta be careful about the line. Cause I'm doing, my, my style is like a comb over, but you gotta have a nice line. I haven't cut my hair recently, so this is a bit long. But when you're blow drying, if you start blow drying this hair up, it's gonna fuck it up. So you gotta make sure this shit's down, and that when you're blow drying, you're not screwing up your line. Even though I want to go over, I'm, I'm pushing it up so I get some volume to it. Otherwise, your hair looks flat. And if you have a comb over, but you have really flat hair that goes over and to the right and down, we're a mustache away from problematic. And that's it, that was quick. That was like five minutes, I don't know. Well, we're not done yet in the bathroom, okay? Cause this is what you guys are also fucking up. 
and I'm, I specifically mean guys, not like how I say boys at the start of video, but I mean anyone watching. Because this, I think, is mainly a guy problem. Uh, get, get, go, tell your parents or go out yourself and get some face wash and then rinse your face every day and use moisturizer every day. It's just goaded. I didn't realize. You know how people used to say sniper get down? I'm, I'm like flawless. I mean, actually, that's cap. I have a shit ton of acne scars, but I just think it would help you guys. That's all. And by the way, I didn't put that much in my hair. I could have put more. It's a little floofy. So it'll probably look a little more natural, but not as high up as, as like a news anchor, but that's fine. But it will make me play with it more, which some people hate. I get so many hate comments. Some people don't watch me because I play with my hair too much. <sighs> All right, that wasn't playing with my hair. I was putting it back. This is what I'm using right now. It's got SPF, even though it's dark out, but it's like, I don't know, SPF's good for you. The cool thing about washing your face every day is that you feel gross if you don't. And then if you wash your face but you forget moisturizer, you feel really dry. All right, well this is my meal tonight. Mac and cheese. This looks disgusting. What is this? Why are they pretending to have grill lines? Like this was fucking grilled. Ugh. It just looks like a sausage. This tastes like ash. Like the ash that leaves your cigarette after smoking it. It has this carcinogen after flavor. Ugh. All right, well, it's about it, boys. That's the hair tutorial. I, I promise this takes me five minutes, 10 minutes at absolute max. And it's a game changer, honestly. If don't take my word for it, to take this, this guy's toast's word for it. All right, I'm the one that inspired him to start doing his hair. And he's like new hottie on, on well, not on Twitch. <laughs> Maybe one day back on Twitch. If you got five minutes and you want and you want nice hair and people to compliment your hair before you eventually go bald because, you know, father bald will come for us all, then get a hair dryer. Some product, whether you use Cremo hair thickener or any pomade, wax is fine. Uh, American fiber, that's great too. I'll put all those in the description. I won't, I'll forget. But you, I've said them out loud, so that should be helpful. Tweet me out, hashtag Ludwig hair, and I'll, you know, and I'll be, I'll, I'll, I'll try to support you, okay? Cause you know, I'd, I'd like for you guys to, to look better. Cause frankly, you've, you've been looking like shit lately and <laughs> school starting back up. We don't want another no hose September, do we? So let's, let's get to it, fellas and lady. I don't know actually what, I don't think you use any of the hair product I used. If you're a woman, I think inherently you already have mastered looks a bit more because since like, I mean, really the ancient times, a lot of your value has, has been your looks. Unfortunately, it's how society was structured was that this is weird conversation I have with you guys. That's it. All right, boys, that's it. Hopefully you guys enjoyed and this was somewhat helpful or entertaining. And if it was neither, um, consider subscribing because the next one might be. Bye.